Let's learn about follicle stimulating hormone, luteinizing hormone, and prolactin. These hormones are secreted by the pituitary gland, which is located just under the brain in the sphenoid bone. The anterior portion of the pituitary gland contains a vascular network called the hypophyseal portal system. There is a two-step process for releasing anterior pituitary hormones. First, a releasing hormone is secreted by the hypothalamus. The releasing hormone travels to the anterior pituitary through the blood vessel system. Next, an anterior pituitary hormone is secreted in response to the releasing hormone. Let's look at one releasing hormone known as gonadotropin releasing hormone, or GNRH. GNRH facilitates the release of two hormones, follicle stimulating hormone, or FSH, and luteinizing hormone, or LH. Let's look at FSH. In females, FSH helps the ovarian follicle develop and promotes estrogen secretion. In males, FSH promotes sperm development. The other hormone that responds to GnRH is luteinizing hormone, or LH. In females, LH stimulates ovulation and promotes secretion of estrogen and progesterone by the ovaries. In males, LH stimulates the production of testosterone. Prolactin is another hormone released by the anterior pituitary, but is not affected by GnRH secretion. Prolactin promotes milk production by the mammary glands. Prolactin secretion is partially controlled by one hypothalamic releasing hormone called prolactin inhibiting hormone, or PIH. PIH works to inhibit the secretion of prolactin by the anterior pituitary. We hope you have learned something about FSH, LH, and prolactin and... See you next time.